watch the grave, but I would encourage you, you know, to go straight into the cathedral. Then they can start the little chat, get that over with, and then you can wander around, okay? Once again, and I'm going to emphasize this one more time, at the grave itself, the ground is very, very uneven, and it is quite easy to slip. So just be very, very careful there, all right? Um, We'll be good. You better be too. good. <laughs> and we'll be back on the coach for 11.40 if possible, and then we'll make our little drive to Saul Church. So the thing I like about St. Patrick's grave is he's one of the most famous saints throughout the entire world. If this was in another country, they would have a glass case around his grave, which is fundamentally a great big slab of stone, okay? They would have a great big case around it and lights. It's not like that. It's just a slab of stone on the side of a hill. But I think it's all the better for its yes. simplicity. Yes. And here's the other thing. Remember I said there were some extras today? So you're going to get three saints for the price of one. <gasps> Because there are three saints that are buried in there, St. Bridget and St. Columba, also known as St. Columcu. So, I mean, you don't often get to hear the, the phrase, three saints for the price of one. Um, but yes, they're all buried in the same grave. So we're just stuck in the traffic here, obviously, in downtown Don Patrick. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, Saturday, it's a bit of a year. Oh, it's, it's crazy, isn't it? It's, just, it's gone wild. Feral, feral Don Patrick. I was dead. Richard? Yes? Do many people, particularly the young people, smoke? No. Good. Uh, there are less people that smoke nowadays. Because um, we've had uh, trouble with the vaping. Oh, the yeah. kids are doing the vaping and also, they're trying to eradicate that. Lots of people do vaping. Yeah. That is something that happens. And it's worse. Especially Apparently it's worse for you, isn't it? Oh, yes. yeah. That's yes. what they say. Much higher uh, uh, attitude. No, really? you, you might notice that I cough. I cough. I've got quite a chesty cough. That's because I have a weak chest because my mother and my. <laughs> <as well. laughs> they call it uh, secondhand smoke. Yeah. Yes, so that's, that's me. Nice. So that's why you'll hear me as if I, I as if I've been a sixty a day man, but I'm, I'm not. <laughs> so have a see when we go up this street here. This is English Street. When you go up English Street. You can imagine this street, this street hasn't changed very much in about 250 years. So you can imagine walking down here in your crinolines, your big skirts. <laughs> and that's just the man. <laughs> <laughs> on the side here, on your right hand side, this is the old courthouse. And then there's an old jailhouse here, which is now a museum, uh, which is free to uh, visit when it's open. Then there's Down Cathedral right in front of you now. And then there's the old schoolhouse which dates from, I think, 1737 there. So this street, I just think this street is fantastic because it really, it's kind of, if you take away the cars, it's almost untouched by time. So no more uh, jail, that means no more crime. <laughs> uh, no, there are modern jails, that just, they just don't use that one. So right here, on Mark, these are the these are these on the left hand side. These are the gravestones you'll want to explore. Behind these two trees, this is where St Patrick's grave is. That's his grave right there. So guys, we're going to be back on the coach for 11:40, and um, if you follow me in now, then the. the